New at noon, a major undercover operation targeting child predators ends with more than 100 people arrested in Polk County, including a theme park worker. The sheriff's office saying it was all a result of a multi-agency effort investigating human trafficking and prostitution. News 6's Amanda Castro explains how law enforcement caught them. 108 people are facing charges arrested in a six day undercover human trafficking operation called Operation March Sadness 2. We're online to stop them from getting to children. Polk County Sheriff Grady Judd says his agency worked with local law enforcement to take down John seeking prostitutes as well as free victims from human trafficking. But he says the grand slam arrests were these four child sex predators. It, this is huge. Four arrests of this magnitude in a week are, is simply remarkable. Including 27-year-old Xavier Jackson, a lifeguard at Disney. He thought he was chatting with a 14-year-old, and he sent photos of himself doing things that's totally inappropriate. And another big arrest during the operation, 32-year-old Tiffany Nash. It's not often we arrest traffickers at the undercover site, but we did. Judd says Nash worked at an Orlando KFC. He says she was arrested during the operation for trafficking a young woman. She would force this young lady, this victim, to come along. This deal was for $300. If this lady were lucky, she would get $20. Judd says law enforcement was lucky they found the victim and got her help. So she's not criminally charged and she's not up here on this board because she's immediately turned over and treated as a victim, not a criminal suspect in an event. Judd adding law enforcement will not stop until criminals like this are behind bars. We'll be back. And if you violate the law, we're going to take you to jail. That's a guarantee. Amanda Castro, Getting Results, News 6. News 6 has asked Disney for a comment about Jackson's arrest. We're told he is on unpaid leave.